Hey everybody, we're back surf fishing at New Smyrna Beach for the first time in three and a half months. It's past one o'clock in the afternoon. It's gruesomely hot and we're probably gonna get wet, but we had to try to make a trip down here because it's been so long. Only one rod today for sure. It's super hot and we're gonna try to get a shark. Wow, I'm just getting the camera set up. She's got one. You better not. Wow, just a little whitey. And I thought you might have had something else. I thought it was a baby fish. Okay. All right, that's a good size whitey. It is a big. Okay. That's good, man. Is it hot? Unhook it and throw it back up there. In New Smyrna Beach. New Smyrna Beach. Our first fish at New Smyrna Beach. Our first trip back in three and a half months. Wow, is it hot. She's already got another one. Yeah, on most of our trips by 1.30, we're at least packing it up. Nice wow, that's a nice size whiting. This is, this is straight fish bites, no uh, sand, oh, sand fleas. Oh, did you cut some? Okay. All right, throw it up there. I gotta get that shark rod out there. All right, here's the open up shark bait. She's got those two whiting. They're pretty big too, around 12 inches. So that's what's going out first. It's about an hour and a half after high tide. The conditions look pretty good. And with those two big whiting, I got plenty of bait. I don't want to hear standing out here in the sun because it's gruesomely hot. Oh, wow. Uh-oh. Look at this. Wow, a shark just bit that whiting clean in half. She was just reeling that thing. Look at it dripping the blood. Okay, shit. Wow, well, get a good look at that. Wow, he I just feel like that. A little pop. Wow, that's probably a black nose shark. But it could have been a smaller black tip. <laughs> wow, that's wow. something. We've had them uh, cut our rigs off, but we've never got in just a half of whiting. Okay, I showed you the whiting head before I threw it out there. The black nose sharks have been biting at that and they ripped all the fins off. But if you see how the hook is turned back in in itself, if we would have hooked the black tip, most likely that hook wouldn't have uh, got into his skin because it, it's back inside the whiting head. So I got to rehook it. I might put a little chunk of whiting. Evidently the black nose sharks are out there, big time. Okay, I put the the little whiting head that the shark bit in half when she reeled it in. I cut that little bite mark off the back to make it smaller. And they bit all the little fins off that big whiting head. Man, I, I don't think I've ever seen that. It looks like it's gonna be a black nose shark day. I don't like uh, catching the black nose sharks on uh, this heavy gear. But we went on one trip, she got three pull downs, all little four foot black nose sharks and she caught them on this outfit. I'm putting smaller and smaller pieces on there. That's the last third of the whiting by the tail. That's pretty tough meat. So I scaled it and hooked it a little bit deeper. And I think we're gonna get them on this piece. All right, we're on. Wait a minute, wait a minute. I told you don't mess with a drag. Is it on there? Huh? Yeah, it's on. Hold on. Tighten the drip. Just wait, wait. I don't. I think it's a black nose. Could be a ray, too. Don't let him get slack in it. You want me to tighten Yeah.
You think so? Tighten the drag up a little bit more. Ray, and probably a medium-sized one, too. I don't think he's a big one. I mean, hell, it could be a nurse shark, too. It's a ray. Watch the tail. Oh, you don't have to cut their tails off, just flip them over. Okay. And then... There it is. Meet. Watch. Then you can grab them by their little eye socket things. It doesn't hurt them. She got the medium-sized stingray. It pulled a little drag. Sometimes you don't know. We've had five and a half, six foot black tips that look like they're a black nose shark and then they take off running. So you gotta be prepared for that. And I definitely want her on this rod for a big stingray. I don't like catching the black nose sharks on the big game rod, but we'll take whatever we can get. You seen the chunk I put on before, that's what's left of it. Those are black nose sharks, or possibly the shark nose. Usually the black nose will jack that rod down. That's not happening, so they could be shark nose sharks too. So now, I'm putting on another piece of the tail section. I scaled it. And hooked it a little bit deeper. That's what we got the stingray on. And if the black nose shark grabs that, that that's that should be pretty good. So let's see. I don't know what we got here. This this acting like a black nose. What do you think? Tighten the drag up a little bit. I think that's a black nose. Yeah. Ain't no black tip. Yeah, get closer to the water. There you go. Real as you go. I think he's a black nose. Okay. He's a black nose and he's a good size one too. Okay, I'm trying to get the black nose in with the GoPro. It's raining. That's a good black nose shark. 
You can see his little black nose. Maybe, maybe not. I'm going to try to get him off without any pliers. They're strong as hell, man. Okay, I'm going to have to get the pliers. That's a good black nose, Shark. Yeah. He's about four foot. Yeah, that's a big black nose, Shark. Okay. Okay, you got it? I'm letting that thing go. Okay. Those things will bite your ass. Okay. Bye bye. Okay, well, that was a good sized black nose shark. He was kind of thick, about four foot. They usually don't get much bigger than four foot, so that's a big one. So what I did was cut one of the bigger whiting heads all the way back to the gills and then cut all the fins off to make it smaller. And I'm gonna throw that out there. It started to downpour on us right as we were trying to unhook the black nose shark, which I had a hell of a time with. I don't like them. I don't like nurse sharks either. I think she's got another one. We've totally lost track. I think it's like nine or something. She said the whiting are bigger at New Smyrna Beach than Ormond Beach. By the bend in that rod, that's a bigger white. Oh, oh, hold it up. That's why it seemed bigger. No, hold it up by the leader. She hasn't caught that in a long time. A double whiting on the sand perch rig. Good job. Good job. They're, they're decent size. Yeah. Okay. All right. All right. So she, she's having a hell of a day, actually. Yeah. She liked it when the shark bit her whiting in half when she was reeling it in. She's having one of her best days in a long time. Definitely let him go. Man, that, that's probably 12 or 13 whiting or 15 or who knows. And they're all decent size. Yeah, they're I'm decent thinking. size, not like the small ones at Ormond Beach. Okay, we're wrapping it up. It's getting dark as hell. It's fixing to rain on us. We got a nice four foot black nose. Oh, you can hear the thunder. A good stingray. And she probably caught 15 whiting. So we had a good day today, our first trip back at New Smyrna Beach. We gotta hurry up, let's go.